name is Ignacio Marquez. Um, I am the community liaison for the Washington State Department of Ag. Uh, Director Hober was appointed in uh, April of this year, and he came in with a different view of of how we um, how the agency should be more involved around issues related to labor, and not just you know the the ongoing challenge that we have every every year about not finding enough workers, but really. Uh, connecting with the workforce and really seeing how is it that this agency could advocate and support um, uh, the the services and programs that the workforce needs, because in the end, you know, this is the workforce that has been keeping the the ag industry successful, and so we need to make sure that uh, we take care of that workforce, uh, because um, as we've seen in the previous years. Uh, there's less and less people that um, that uh, can do this work and are willing to do this work. So um, we need to take care of the existing workforce. So um, my background is that uh, I, I used to work with the Employment Security Department, which manages uh, employment offices throughout the state. I managed uh, s several um, employment offices in. Uh, Central Washington that um, that will obviously serve the ag industry. Um, I used to also manage the federal H-2A program for the state that would allow uh, foreign workers to to come into um, into Washington to perform the ag work that uh, perhaps we didn't have enough workers to perform. Um, so. I, I have some knowledge of, of the labor issues, and uh, being a farm worker myself, um, you know, I understand the hard work. I understand uh, some of the challenges that our uh, workforce is facing right now, as far as you know, um, you know, finding a, a safe and reliable housing, or you know, uh, finding services to make sure that their children are are being taken care of while the adults go to work or um, or even making sure that there's medical services in the areas where they, uh, the workforce lives. 